I've heard, um, what I've heard, rumors that Defoe was really good at fighting Steve. Um, I've heard these rumors because um, apparently whenever Onan fights Defoe, he goes like other characters. Um, so we'll have to see how this goes. See who he picks. Well, Every time I've seen Noodles, I've seen him play Steve. I thought Noodles was pretty much a solo Steve. I don't, I don't think he has another character really. Um, but yeah, I've heard, I've heard Nicole's really good at fighting Steve. But I've heard. So. Oh, okay. <laughs> when you just want to hear the announcer speak the names. All right. Shulk versus Enderman. Yeah, me too. Big fan of mashing. Alright, starting out pretty strong here, Defoe. Using the blocks against him. How do you like it? Got smash, he went for it. Yeah, you pull throwing out some of those smash attacks like Nigel Thornberry. He's like, smashing. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> he does, well, you know, mashing, smashing. <laughs> Technically, you could smell smash, smashing with a three in front of it, so if you just look, it would be like I less than or equal to smashing. Oh, and catches him on the recovery. Very nice, Defoe. Guys, the answer to your problem is Shulk. Just play Shulk. Everybody should <laughs> just play Shulk. Everyone should harness the Minato's power. Oh, very nice. All right, Defoe kind of holding his, you know, really holding his ground here in his advantage. He's only at 97, really not letting Enderman here land. And we know that he's not scared to go out there and smack him and whack him. Oh, nice! Love the smash. Yeah, that move has some scoop to it. <laughs> I know it does. He's got Buster. Mining his own business. Haha, uh -huh, Steve mining his own business. <laughs> oh, the cart, not enough to kill him yet. No, we are still alive. <laughs> oh, he's going for it. Smack him out. Smash, he wants it. That smash our up is so good from Shulk. Alright. Defoe taking that game. Three, oh, we got three that. Maybe, you know, Shulk seems to be a pretty good answer to Steve. Yeah. I mean, you kind of, with the speed art, you can kind of just get close to Steve to threaten him so he can't mine. And with the range combined with the speed art, it's like... Yeah, I was going to say, I don't even think Steve's got diamonds. No. I, Defoe really, you know, the game, you know, the match started, he was on top of him, he held him there, kept him in the air, really didn't let him mine. I think he only had like a yeah. A couple of seconds where he had a little bit of mind, and then Defoe literally ran up and was like, no. Three, two, All right, one, Hollow Bastion. Go, All right, start off speed. Run at him. What's he going to do? Apparently that. Apparently you can juggle you can juggle Shulk forever in, in shield art when, with up tilt. <laughs> All right, this game's starting off a little bit differently this time. Looks like Noodles is finding a little bit more of what he needs to do against Shulk. He's got the mine card, but Shulk says, I don't have my driver's license. I'm not getting in there. Yeah, Raymond. Noodles is doing a lot more mining this time, or really not letting the foe run away with it. In general, also, he's setting up blocks right in front of him, too, delaying his 
Yeah. Delaying Shulk a little bit enough to get what he needs. Oh, he catches him. Not in. dead, but because of shield art. And he's at 168. What a what a difference. Oh yeah. The difference between shield art and speed art, how how much knockback it does. Big. Alright, he's got smash. Oh he's dead. <gasps> he's dead. That's yeah. unfortunate. That's unfortunate. He went for smash because he really wanted to do it, but then he ended up off stage and wasn't able to make the jump yeah. back. Downer? Oh, or just fair. That works also. Yeah. And now he's got jump art, so he's gonna make it back. Yep. I actually think the Paul could still bring this game back. Oh, 100%. He's, not, he's pretty far behind, but like, but still, <laughs> he's pretty far behind. But like, I feel like he just needs a couple good hits. Like this might, he, he might even kill off this interaction. Not, not quite. But I mean, as we saw in game one, like he gets in, you know, he stays in. He's able to kind of like oppress. Steve and not let him do normal Steve things. Yeah, oh yeah. So if he's able to get in and kind of hold that, hold that position, we can see a turnaround. Oh here. my gosh, that spiked off of the the block and the block disappeared. Yeah, right, he's got smash, you know he wants something. And he gets it, see? You were right. Now he's only Commentators, at that's the opposite of commentators curse, that's commentators blessing. <laughs> it's what that is. <laughs> Oh, oh like, no, 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 that's not gonna kill. No oh. way. It's not. Oh, but that's gonna kill. Yeah. All right. Well, maybe maybe that wasn't commentator's blessing. Maybe that was commentator. It was close. It was close. I mean, he really, it, it really did look like he could have like brought yeah. it back. You oh, know, yeah. He was able oh, to yeah. close out that second stock. He was only at 56%. I'd call it the problem is like you have to get in and stay in. And, you yeah, know, Noodles, yeah. you know, after that game, I think he kind of knows what he wants to do to make you stay out. <laughs> like, he doesn't want you getting all that crazy Shulk stuff off like he was game one. Love the music. Yeah, it's a good song. All right, all right. Defoe puts his clothes back on. He's using the Shulk with the, sh with the shirt on this time. I have to see how that changes things. Okay, <laughs> weird side note, but when I was watching him play earlier, the game that he lost, he was naked Shulk, and then when he put clothes back on, he won. <laughs> so think, I'm thinking maybe. You're thinking the Shulk, the, it's the, the clothes. skin choice, maybe. I think the clothes keep him warm, keep his, keep his fingers nice and warm. <laughs> All right, he's got Smash. Oh, but Steve is not letting him use it. All right, he goes back with Jump. Oh. oh. <laughs> He's, holding, he's got a little bit of a lead here, a little bit of a lead. He's got stage right now. A little too early. Yeah, Steve, his recovery is really good, actually. And now he's kind of, the folks kind of respecting the space a little bit more. He's got jump. He wants to do it. Gets back, smash. There we go. Flat out, he's dead, yeah. bit of a trade there. Ooh, gets hit by the cart. A little bit of a cover. Ooh, wow. Here it is. Oh, he broke the box. Yeah. I was gonna say you're gonna get caught, but he lives. The the field old, art. Yeah. I see that he can like change it in there too. Oh, off your own block. Off your own block. That's funny. I think Bam, you're on to something. He put Shulk put his clothes back on. And now he, he won that one. So funny coincidence? I think not. <laughs> I don't think it's just a coincidence. All right, Shieldar, when he's getting a little bit 
Take that. He's able to do a little bit more mining. You know, Defoe's not really being as up in his face now. Noodles isn't letting him. to go for somebody who's going to lose the art. Run him down. Got sent the... Oh my gosh, I felt like he was almost going to get hit by that. I think... Yeah, definitely. Oh, he's oh, dead. No, oh, no, he shield, changed art. Shield. Yeah. Can you just change art in the middle of that up smash? Then? I think so. Been... I think so. It would make sense because you can shield art out of hit stun. So oh. I guess that makes sense. That's I didn't think he was gonna make it back from that, and he did. And then he cleaned out Noodle's first stock. He's sitting at 116. That's gonna kill. Oh, he tried that time and only got Buster, so he died. Didn't get shield out of that. But you know, it's like you said. You know, Defoe. If he's able to find his way in and kind of keep that pressure going, then. We could see a little reversal here, or we might get a game five if Noodles is able to kind of keep him at bay like this. Oh, yeah. It just seems like a lot of the things that he's that he wants to do with Shulk just aren't really connecting, and then, you know, Noodles being able to build up those walls, he's got to break them down, and now, boom, he's got Diamond, it looks like. He's going to get racked up. Oh, buddy! He got hit by like three things in a row. <laughs> and that's another game five. It's so crazy that Minecraft Steve is in Smash Bros. I'm just watching him play and I'm like, wow, what a time to be alive, huh? Minecraft Steve in Smash Bros. The year is 2022. The year is 2022, it really is. It really is, this video game is insane. All right, another game five. Winner of this will continue through top 24 winner side. Another one will be in losers. Oh boy. All right, PS2. Shulk has no clothes again. I feel like, yeah, it's like when um, when Dufault loses, he like take either puts his clothes back on or takes his clothes off, depending on what he did before. Yeah, like, it probably just changes the vibe. I mean, if I were Shulk, I, I would probably behave differently if I was in my underwear. It was as big as my clothes. Oh my. <laughs> I guess it's a swimsuit. I apologize. It's a swimsuit. Top of TNT. All right, he got in a little bit, got in. See if he can close out the stock or if he was going to cart away. Yeah, build that wall. Oh, he wanted it. Oh, nice avoid on the anvil. Anvil is pretty scary stuff. Grab, okay. But yeah, I don't think, um, he doesn't have any iron, I don't think, does he? So he can't mine cart. So he's stuck to just using blocks to stall his momentum. And not yet, not yet. I'm surprised not yet. 
Ooh, I was a little bit worried. Yeah. I was like, he was recovering kind of high, and Steve was ready. Good fade. Yeah, good fade. That's just going to kill you. Great. Now he has iron, because once you die, I guess you get iron. <laughs> so you get minecart, and you did minecart there. See if Defoe can get a pretty good amount of extra credit on him. That could be pretty big. <laughs> Bruh, that's the upside down. <laughs> just, you just see blocks. You're like, oh, okay. All right, good job chasing him on the other side. Carries him all the way off stage. We've got Buster. In the cart and carried away. Not, Not gonna die though. Oh, that, did, that one did so much knockback in shield art. I can't yeah. believe that. He's alive. All right, yeah, he was able to with the fire block. Do it. But you know what? Defoe was able to rack up Steve to 76, so it's not too bad. All things but it's Steve, you gotta, res you gotta respect his space. Oh. Send them flying. Smash. Try to do. Oh, oh off your own yeah. block. when the block betrays you. Yeah. All right, so this is a pretty decent lead right now for Defoe. He's only sitting at 58% still has two stocks, but he's Raymond Noodles still in it. As we've seen Raymond Noodles do before in the two other games, you know, he can he can bring it back. He's got shield art. Jump. A lot of players are getting a lot better at, like, with anvil shield pressure and getting out of it, and Defoe's doing a really good job of getting out of it. Ooh, breaks his cart. Oh, oh gets smacked all the way to the other side of the stage. He broke my cart. He broke my heart. Oh, this could be it. Oh, oh no. no. No, he's got jump, he's got jump, he's got... Wait, what happened? The game broke. What does that mean for ruling? I don't... Because usually if you pause the game, you have to SD. I don't know if that applies here. Oh, here comes, here comes the T.O. All right, guys. Here comes the T.O. You know, we don't know if Shulk wasn't going to make it back or not. That's true. I feel like he he actually probably would have made that back, I feel like, but... It was really hard to tell because the game was... cut out before it... The game cut out. I... I uh, T.O.'s... I guess we're <laughs> we're figuring out what the ruling's gonna be. I'm a little. We got cages. Yeah, TOS the ball. I mean, they got cages up here. This is this is this is such a hard call. <laughs> Everyone is, I think, torn. I'm hearing different things shouted down there. They're talking about like the technicalities of like pausing the game. Popped off so hard. Everyone's like down there waiting to hear the tea, hear the final ruling. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, as for Kayla saying, still up being. It was 
the game cut off at such a bad time because yeah. I thought he might snap to it, but I I'm not sure. I, and I honestly think, I feel like he was going to make it back. I really do feel like he was. Yeah, because he was in jump art. Yeah, I think he was going to snap personally. That's kind of what I, I know, feel it's, like. I know, it's hard to tell. It's, I feel like, I feel like you were going to snap. Yeah, no, from what? It's, it's, I don't know if y'all can hear the crazy routing here. We have a crowd down there, all kind of shouting. What's the ruling going to be? So did, um, this shit's unprecedented. This shit's unprecedented. Well, wait, so did the game cut out because Raymond yeah, hit the table? Yeah, he touched the table. He like, touched he the table off, and popped off. So and I the game like, disconnected. I feel like Raymond would lose then because he is the one who disconnected. Yeah, because and Defoe was in the middle of an What is going game. on on Pokemon Stadium 2? Oh, no. What is going on? Guys, what's up? <laughs> what's hey, up, what's up? What's going on? Is this crazy? What's going on, what's going man? On? We were just talking, of, me and Cheesecake thought he was going to snap back. It was too early to tell. Whoa, why? Is, somebody's getting cooked number two here at Lansing. Yeah, someone's getting someone's roasted. Getting cooked, roasted, grilled. Heat it off, microwave, left out. What you call it? I keep hearing you touch the table. You can't touch the table. I mean, it's fine to touch the table. Just don't knock the switch out of the yeah, back. Oh, <laughs> this is so unfortunate. It is, yeah. I don't know what chat's saying. Chat, what do you think? What do you think? Everyone down there just debating. Oh man, I've never in all of the couple years, two, three years that I've been here, I've never witnessed such an event. These are rare in Smash Bros because there's usually a clear defined winner and a clear defined loser. In yeah, much but this Smash is like Bros so sets. tricky. Oh, it really is. It's really tricky. We got Kajas out here with yeah. the ruling. We got Chai Dude out here with the ruling. Kajas came walking out there. He's like, listen, guys. Pull Captain. Chai dude out here, Cages out here. What's the, what's the, what's, I think Defoe actually offered to replay the whole game. That's what it sounded like. I think Kate just okay. wanted the DQ. I think Defoe oh, offered, offered to re it. replay. Okay. Yeah. From what I mean, I he started heard. with like he lost the game, so I wasn't sure. Guys, this is the first game six I've ever commentated before. All right, we're running it back. This is, this game is, five, Defoe versus Noodles. Guys, this is a game six. Game, game five. Six. Game six. And yes. he put the clothes back on. Oh yeah. All right, let's see. My guy knows. De Defoe, I think, has the cover. Yo, Defoe, knows after that back. whole debate, look at him go. He wants it. He's going to jump for it. Ooh, catches him coming back. Defoe feeling himself now that game six, it hits different. <laughs> oh, it does. Really, a game six. Game six hits different. Oh, he catches him again. Not enough to kill him yet. Probably almost stealing that up smash. <laughs> oh, Probably, yeah, he's catch on it shield. It. Let's see if he can keep that pressure on. All right, we got smash oh. art. Nice, nice recovery though. Nice recovery from Raymond. Doesn't Getting out of that. Here. That's oh, dead, catches though. him up. That's Ooh. dead though. All right. I'm telling you, game six, everybody, it hits different. I got to calm down. That was dramatic. All right, he's got Buster. Let's see what Noodles can do. Bro, I couldn't even imagine the mental toe of having to like argue with the TO about this. So now you have to come back and play the game. Kids, this is a lesson to you all. Don't. Oh. Um, oh man, I thought. I mean, no, but also. Oh, get close. I'm feeling so intense right now. Oh, oh no, yeah. under stage. That's so unfortunate. 
I was going to say, you know, that not only, like, the mental, like, gameplay-wise, but, like, the mental toll of thinking yeah. that you won the game and then you have to replay the whole thing, and there was a big debate. Yeah, kids, this is what happens. Uh, don't pop off too hard, okay? That's the lesson to learn from this. Don't slam the table. Yeah, don't touch the table. Because Raymond might have actually won the set had, had he not done that. He, yeah, I, he just was like, don't, I don't care. Don't touch the table. Right. Oh, the foe going out for it. He's feeling himself. Sitting at three stocks, 71%. Raymond is kind of having a hard time recouping over here. Oh, getting caught. So many up smashes. Third time. Aww. Unfortunate. unfortunate. I think Noodles called it done. Yeah. Very unfortunate. That game six hits differently. Oh, yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, we definitely support popping off. We love people making progress and progressing in tournament, especially in high intense situations, but don't touch the table. Don't touch the table. Or so a message from KJ's head to you.